show. A hello, Vicky. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drive-bys along the way. <laughs> no, no. Unfortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... bir kıyafetlerimizi giyelim abi Evet. Başka buradan bir şey almamıza gerek var mı? Sanırım yok. Kilit mi? Al. Garip ya. Şimdi karakterimizi bu arada bir geliştirelim. bir şey kasalım. Ne atalım ya? Ender şahır ötelim. Şu 
شما چه میریم به برسن چی پیدا از آنم کن کن بست داستا بهش من بکنم شما را آهیم اینمان خانتا بیرم بیدش اگر آنسو کن آنسو پرسن که آنم اتون آنسو اگر آنسو دیگه راست شیعه پال اونا گیدیم آنها گیمیمیزی دا آیا Parçaları nereden alacağız acaba ya? Şimdi silahları seçelim bir tabanca. Ki gerekli. Hiç gövde. Hiç gövde. Mesela ben şeyi nasıl takip ediyorum? Biraz o karışık. Taskı. Şimdi bu Vat son diye bir yerde Siber Yaz kumakası Pardon Siber Sayın kumakası Öğrendi öğrendi Vat son Şimdi Vat son neresi Burası Önemli öyle Hepsinden ama Önemli değil mi? Hangisi bu? Ana, ana şey bu. Nereye çıkar ki? Nereye çıkar? Ya 
Night City is not as easy as you think. Increased gang activity. The mayor's office has raised the public threat level to red. Hello, I'm Eric McDonald with WNS News. Today is a sad one in our city's history. Mayor Lucius Ryan has passed away. We have learned of Mayor Ryan's death from his family. He died peacefully in his sleep. The exact cause of his death has not been released. Initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming elections. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss of our mayor. So. Oğlum niye vuruyorsunuz lan bana? Kızım var lan araba.
to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. We begin now with your latest local news. The 54th anniversary of the AHQ disaster is fast approaching. In 2023, Night City was shaken to its core by the detonation of a tactical nuclear bomb in Arasaka's NC headquarters. 12,000 were killed in All right, let's see what you got. What I like to hear. Beş buradan alan bu arada. Bir tırsdım ama satalım hepsini. Dolar da hiçbir şey yok ki lan. Hangi silah alayım abi? not look so bad then in the car I doubted you would survive this about the biochip that why I'm here hmm I hear it's damaged beyond the repair any attempt to extract it will be disastrous fatal for you Vic likes to talk I guess not many could do what he did you should be thankful Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. Yeah. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone. 
very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does that corporation help her? You ask a lot of questions. You have many interesting things to say. Might be your turn now to say something interesting. I intend to punish Yorinobu Arasaka severely for the crime he has committed. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge, much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. Himmler. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. We'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. If that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? 
He was the one to alert Saburo san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor. I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper doubles and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Our sock is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Chris's past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us.
Hey, look. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. We're closed right now. I'm uh, looking for Evelyn Parker. Know where I might find her? Used to come round. Haven't seen her in a while, though. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into him. embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You done with that bug, will you? Yep. Bar's closed. about strays go take care of your guests Suze, we're not done here oh yeah we fucking are you just don't give up do you got nothing more to say to me moxes and nomads don't seem so different both seem to yammer a lot about community solidarity classic dilemma what comes first Family or the outside this is world. A club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community, solidarity, classic dilemma. What comes first, family or the outside this world? Is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble and either you fly high or sink into quicksand Susie seems to know what she wants is she your boss you come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks listen have you seen Evelyn need to talk to her it's important why so you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist Seem to know how the heist went, meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombath killed like a real pro. She commissioned the heist, not me. No, you're the one who fucked it up. You weren't there. You don't know Jack. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. What's clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. 
You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghost before I call the girls. Hold on, a dollhouse? Is Evelyn a regular there? Or a drone? You're a real pain in the ass. You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. I'm guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. Pisses at share a cost, too. Why, looking to invest? Nah, I'm just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. Where'd you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first, just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtue. Kaku Akata, Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Have been corrupted with malware. Have this this time. Experts have confirmed the identified. 
Brain dance chick is hiding somewhere. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. The mayor's office has raised the public threat level. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brain dead dude drags me around a cat house on a wild horse chase. So having a grand old time. Schools and hospitals. Why? Why? Little something called intuition. Ever heard of it? Designed as an oasis of luxury has become a den for violent gangs and drug lords. So hold on. Welcome to Cloud, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay.
guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know where she might be? Parker? Uh, that was some drama. I don't know who started it, though. Client or her. Is there anything you do know? Come on, pussy! You're talking to the wrong doll, honey. You really want to know? Talk to Tom. Even better, Woodman. Where will I find Woodman? Back office. Upstairs. Are you sure you want to do that, though? Just said I should, didn't you? They'll kill you if you try. Well, why's that? What's this Woodman do? Nah, -uh. I'm done. I could get fired for all the shit I've told you already. Just get out. Where you got to, coward? Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be. Vincent? V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V. You're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Look for someone named Evelyn Parker. I used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I stole this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. 
That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there is starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. That thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel... a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear... is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? Now... you find out what it is you need to do. Which is... you're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta Burn it all to the ground. Then Thanks, let it burn. Uh, for all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Vargin, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just wanna talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her, but that's all I know. 
Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all.